It's Friday the 12th. I'm at the uh, South Kaibab Trailhead. I'm gonna do a night hike. So here's the route we're taking down to South Kaibab to the Tonto, over to Tonto to the Bright Angel, and up to Bright Angel. So it's about 12, 13 miles, something like that. Four and a half down, four and a half, four over, four and a half up. So um, about 13 miles, I guess. So it's 435, getting on the trail. We'll see how much light we have before we get down to uh, the Tonto. Yeah, here's the first view we have of the inner gorge. Just getting started. I believe through all the kaibab is uh, referred to as the chimney. Some pretty tight switchbacks go down pretty steep. Around five o'clock. Uh, must be, I don't know. 60 something, 70 degrees at the rim. Getting down close to Ua Point here where the views open up of the uh, Tonto level anyway. And uh, starting to get some shadows down there. It looks like the Tonto might have some shadows pretty soon. So that's good. Here we are at Ua Point where the uh, Tonto opens up get a really good view up and down the canyon beautiful yep. i don't know if you can see it but cedar ridge down here and there is O'Neill Butte. So Tonto Lair is right down there. Beautiful night. Quiet. Gorgeous. This is uh, Cedar Ridge up ahead here. I think there's a toilet here. Nice view. And when I get down here, I'll see what time it is. Cedar Ridge. Still pretty sunny. Gonna have some shade pretty soon on the other side of O'Neill Butte right there. But uh, let's see what the time is. 5:20. So we're down here in a little over half an hour. So not too bad. I'm moving pretty good. Uh, let's see what it looks like down here. Uh, beautiful. Just passed a hiker coming up whose name was Grant who uh, informed me, he was having a little trouble himself, but he informed me that his uh, hiking partner is down here a little bit. He says he thinks he's below the tip off. And uh, Grant took this uh, fella Tim's pack for him. And uh, Tim has water, has some Gatorade, but uh, he might be in some pretty bad shape. So we'll see. Uh, See what he's like when we get down here and if he's at the tip off we'll see if we need to call somebody about helping him with some water or something so we'll see if uh this fella tim is down here back in the sun for a little bit and then we go on the uh east side of o'neill butte here so we'll be back in the shade pretty soon and there's the tonto There's the Tonto. I'll be heading over that way and going up the Bright Angel. Sweet, beautiful view. Absolutely gorgeous.
just approaching Skeleton Point eventually down here and uh, can hear to Colorado from here. It's really quiet. I haven't come across Tim yet. Skeleton Point. And a little bit more of a drop down to the Tonto. Let's see what time it is. First view of the Colorado way down there. Doubt if you can see it on the GoPro, but it's a beautiful sight. Uh, I see Tim. Well, I met up with Tim and he looks fine. No problem. Looks like he's pretty good shape now. He is moving up. He's got water, he's got electrolytes, he's got a headlamp. So I think he'll be doing just fine. This section of whites below Skeleton Point is long and and rough. Seems to go on a long time here, but making our way down to... Well, I just came upon a girl who was going up who was really low on water, so I stopped and gave her some water from the ladder that I have. So now I gotta conserve a little bit more water than I thought I, I would. So, it should be okay going over to Tonto to Indian Garden though. It shouldn't take too long. And I can refill plenty of water there. And there is the tip off. Tonto going west. The sun is just about setting. It's cooling off nice. Breezy as all get out, but other than that, good weather. Getting close to the upper miners route that goes up to the south Kaibab below Skeleton Point. Right at that pinnacle there. Hopefully you can see it. It's a Pipe Creek Canyon in here. Heading toward Burrow Spring. Be crossing that spring first and then Pipe Spring. Not sure if you can hear that. It sounds like a bunch of sheep bleeding. Those are actually either frogs or toads down in Pipe Creek, echoing off the walls.
I just went through Burrow Spring, which was uh, pretty mucky and wet. Down in the Pike Creek drainage, more frogs. Also, I spooked some kind of animal. Just ran across the, the creek here. Just walking in the uh, 10 foot circle of light here. Can't tell how far it is to Bright Angel Trail at this point. Gotta be getting close though. Alright, here we are. Indian Garden that way. And we're on the Bright Angel Trail. Done with Tonto East. Okay, at the water at Indian Garden. Let's see what time it is. Nine o'clock. Whew. Off in the distance you can see the uh, South Kaibab Trail. It goes down to Cedar Ridge and past O'Neill Butte and down to Skeleton Point. Eventually down to the tip-off. And the Tonto picks up there, comes down in through Pipe Creek drainage down in here, and then continues on over to the Bright Angel Trail at Indian Garden. And the distinct trail that you can see on the plateau over there is the uh, Plateau Point Trail. That pretty much shows the route.